Bump Saturday by Mr. Bump. Hello, I'm Mr. Bump, and today is Saturday, and what a day it's been. Now, you know why I'm called Mr. Bump, don't you? It's because I keep on having little accidents. But they are not my fault. Really, they just happen. Today, especially. It all started when I woke up this morning. I opened an eye, and then I opened the other eye, and those were about the only things that went right today. The sun was shining in through the bedroom window. What a lovely day, I thought, and I jumped out of bed. Ouch! I had jumped out of bed on the wrong side and hit the bedroom wall. I went into the bathroom, and I tripped over the bath mat and fell into the bath. Ouch! Again! I squeezed the toothpaste out of the tube onto my toothbrush. Oh dear! And then I went downstairs. Actually, I went downstairs much more quickly than usual. Bump, 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 bump. Ouch! Times five. I went into the kitchen to make myself some breakfast. I was going to have a boiled egg, marmalade on toast, and a cup of coffee. What I actually had was boiled coffee, marmalade on floor, and a cup of egg. I picked up the Saturday paper to read what had happened in the rest of the world. I opened it, and somehow or other, it tore into two halves, all by itself. What a way to start the day. Then I thought I would go for a walk. A mistake. I opened my front door. So far, so good. And then I felt something in my hand. What was it? The doorknob. Oh, dear. I stepped outside. Mistake number two. I tripped over the doorstep and staggered into an apple tree and trod on an apple and went head over heels into a prickly rose bush and jumped out and slipped on the grass and finished up in my hedge, half in, half out, a chapter of accidents. I somehow managed to get myself out of the hedge and off I went for my walk. Mistake number three. I saw Mr. Silly, Mr. Greedy, and Mr. Nosy playing football in the park. Hello, they shouted to me. Come and play. I rushed up and took a kick at the ball. A really big kick. Mistake number four. Ouch, shouted Mr. Silly as I kicked him on the shin. I tried again. Ouch, gasped Mr. Greedy, holding his tummy. One more try. A really good try. Ooh, yelped Mr. Nosy, holding his nose. Today had been a very long Saturday. Here a bump, there a bump, everywhere a bump bump. I even managed to trip over poor little Mr. Small, a chapter of accidents. After apologizing to Mr. Small, I thought I had better go home before anything else happened. I couldn't open the door because it didn't have a doorknob, so I had to climb in through the window. By this time, I had lost count of the mistakes I had made, but that was certainly one of them. After I had swept up the broken flower pot, I thought I had better have supper and an early bedtime before anything else went wrong. Cheese on toast seemed a good idea. Well, actually, it finished up as cheese on carpet. And so to bed. It really has been one of those days, I thought to myself as I jumped into bed, and landed in the bed. The flower bed. Somehow or other, I had jumped out of the window. So here I am, sitting in a flower bed, looking at the moon, and thinking what a day today has turned out to be. Just one accident after another. A chapter of accidents. Bump Saturday. One of these days, I'm going to write a book about it.